Hello, let's see a demo of audio transcription editing project type in Shunya. So this is the project page which has the project ID, its description, the type which is audio transcription editing, the status which is published and these are the number of unassigned annotation tasks and the unassigned review tasks. So the annotation tasks dashboard shows the task ID, the domain to which this particular audio file belongs to, the scenario of the audio, the audio duration and the reference raw transcript which shows the words which are being spoken in the audio file. In order to start annotating, you can either click on start labeling now or click on this annotate button. Clicking on the annotate button, this is the annotation page. So, in this audio transcription editing page, the user will be shown this audio file which can be played or paused by clicking on this button play. From here, you can, you can adjust the speed of the audio using this drop down. You can adjust the volume using this volume bar. This is the reference transcript of the words being spoken in the audio. These are the speaker details of the speakers who are a part of this conversation in the audio file. These are the different speaker tags. So, in the case of this audio transcription editing project type, the segments spoken by each of these speakers are already marked. So, the annotator has to just click on each of these regions and then enter the transcription for that particular region. They need not worry about identifying the speaker since that has already been done. So, in order to play a particular segment, the user can double click on that segment and listen to the audio. From here, you can access all the information that the BBB. The user can then enter the transcript for this particular region. Moving on to the next segment. Has made available, available about the company. So, the user can enter the transcript of this particular region as well. So, once all these have been entered, the user can click on update to submit this task. If the annotator wants to skip the task, he can click on skip. Or if he wants to save it as a draft, he can click on draft. For moving on to the next task, the next button can be clicked. So now in order to submit this, I will click on update. So as we can see now, so if we click on any particular region, the transcription would have gotten saved. In case English had not been the language being spoken in this audio and instead it was some other Indic language. So if the user wants to type an Indic language and does not have the Indic keyboard, the transliteration feature can be used. So, click on settings, select transliteration. Now, let us say that Hindi is the language. Start typing the word here. So, you can see the different spelling suggestions written by the transliteration model and the user can choose the correct spelling. Click on copy text, close it and then paste it here. So this way the user can type in Indic languages as well. Thank you.